Hey, how you guys doing? Sean again with Custom Offsets, Custom Offsets TV. We had a lot of questions when we did our wheel and tire vibration video, and a lot of it was around the hub-centric rings and some of the more detail. So we'll get into that. Stay with us. So we had a ton of questions specific around the hub centric rings. What are they, where do they come from and what do they do and how the heck do you install them? This is a good example. We just got this set of fuel Mavericks in and it came with two sets of rings. Because these wheels are dual drilled, remember they had to make this bore a lot bigger so that it can fit both vehicles and become, or lots of vehicles, and become more universal. When you look at a stock wheel, you'll see it's got a significantly smaller bore in it that is set up to fit tightly on the uh, hub of the truck. So if you have this larger gap and you put that on there, there's gonna be an airspace all the way around there. Not only when you're putting it on, does it mean it may not be centered, but it's also putting all the weight and everything on these actual studs. So the two that come with it, one is more uh, for the Chevy. So this has got the Chevy hub size, and then this one is more for the Ford. So this, for this F-150 Platinum, it takes the green ring, and they all have the sizes on them. One size is the size of this hub. The other size is the size of the hub bore in the wheel. So this one is our match. You can see it fits tight into the wheel, and it also fits tight onto the hub. You have to make sure that this fits tight. If this does not go on there tight, it means that it's not the right ring and it's not gonna do anything for you. So the idea is you put the ring on there. Now when you put the wheel on, it's gonna center it on those studs and then you tighten down in your star fashion and then go ahead and lower it down and torque it to spec. That's gonna snug everything up where it's supposed to be and it's gonna help with vibration. Come check this one out. So you can see the back wheel we've got just set on here um, with the ring inside of there. Now there's no more air gap. This ring does not move inside of here. That means that now the wheel's perfectly centered. It's not gonna have any kind of vibration. And as we tightened it in a star pattern, it's perfectly centered on the wheel. So that will make a big difference if you've got a lot of wheel and tire vibration. These things, you can pick them up on eBay, Amazon, wherever for like $10 if they didn't come with your wheels. If you're having a vibration issue, the first thing you should probably do is pull the wheels back off. If when you pull the cap off, you've got that big gap, put these rings in and then give it a shot and see if that'll fix the issue.